hello welcome back to my channel in this video we will discuss about the type of hybridization and magnetic nature of some complex compounds and ions in nico4 the oxidation number of nickel is found to be zero you see the oxidation number of nickel is x over here and for co it is zero and it is a neutral complex so the total oxidation number is zero by solving this equation x is found to be zero so the oxidation number of nickel in this complex is found to be zero then electron configuration of nickel is 4s to 3d8 but 4s is written after 3d so you see 3d8 is written over here then 4s to 3d8 means there are eight electrons 4s2 means there are two electrons and 4p is vacant. In presence of strong field ligands like CO, these electrons get paired off with these unpaired electrons. You see, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. These two electrons will jump to inner 3D and 4s remains vacant 4s remains vacant like 4p0 and this becomes 3d10 here you see one 4s and three p orbitals these three p orbitals and this 4s intermix to form four sp3 hybrid orbitals you see this is 3d10 all the electrons in it get paired up and this 4s and 4p intermix to form 4 sp3 hybrid orbitals here co provides electron pair to each sp3 hybrid orbitals so here four co ligands form four coordinate bonds with ni or you can say each co gives a pair of electron to each sp3 hybrid orbital so nickel is bonded with four co ligands to form a tetrahedral complex and it is diamagnetic because all the electrons are paired in case of nicn4 2 minus tetracyanido nickelate 2 the oxidation number of nickel is plus 2 electron configuration of nickel 2 plus is 4s0 3d8 this is 4s2 3d8 after removal of two electrons it becomes 4s0 3d8 and 3d8 should be written before 4s so it is 3d8 then 4s then this is 4p 3d8 has 8 electrons you see and 4s and 4p remain vacant in presence of cn minus ligands the unpaired d electrons get paired off here cn minus is a strong field ligand so this unpaired electron get paired off with this 3d electron you see 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 this electron will be, be over here or this electron get paired off so this d orbital remain vacant here you see there are two electrons and it becomes vacant 
वन थ्री डी वन फोर एस एंड टू फोर पी ऑर्बिटल्स इंट्रोमिक्स टू फॉर्म फोर डी एस पी टू हाइब्रिड ऑर्बिटल्स वन थ्री डी वन फोर एस एंड टू फोर पी ऑर्बिटल्स इंट्रोमिक्स टू फॉर्म फोर डी एस पी टू हाइब्रिड ऑर्बिटल्स सो हियर दिस इज थ्री डी एंड दिस इज फोर एस फोर पी यू सी दिस थ्री डी दिस फोर एस एंड दिस टू फोर पी इंटरमिक्स टू फॉर्म फोर डी एस पी टू हाइब्रिटल्स एंड इच सी एन माइनस provides two electrons to this four dsp2 hybrids and form a square planar complex as all the electrons get paired off it is diamagnetic in nature in case of nicl4 minus oxidation of nickel is plus 2 electron configuration of nickel 2 plus is 4s0 3d8 3d8 should be written before 4s so 3d8 4s0 is written this is 3d8 then 4s0 4p0 3d8 means there are eight electrons and two electrons remain unpaired since cl minus is a weak field ligand these electrons remain unpaired in presence of these weak field ligands so two 3d electrons remain on pair you see these two electrons remain on pair and this 4s and 3 4p intermix to form 4 sp3 hybrid orbitals and cl minus Each cell minus provides two electrons to these four sp3 hybrids to form a tetrahedral complex. So one four s and three four p orbitals of nickel two plus intermix to form four sp3 hybrid orbitals, mm -hmm. and the shape is tetrahedral. As the electrons remain unpaired, it is paramagnetic. Mm -hmm. 